How are we feeling right now? I have no words. I'm on top of the world. This is the most surreal, incredible feeling I've ever felt yeah. in this sport. So, going into that final event, you said you were in six and you knew that. Yep. So, you know, describe that last event. Do you knew what you had to do and you went out and did it? Yeah. Um, I, I have an amazing support system here and back home and, and all over. Um, and the best advice that I have gotten is to just let the instinct kick in. Kick in. Um, as soon as the, the buzzer went, my I knew what I was supposed to do and let my body just do it. You know, so what I've trained for. It's been a very challenging couple years for me. Uh, I mean, for everybody, of course, with with the pandemic and all that, but in my personal life as well. Um, and this was definitely a breakthrough year for me. Put in a lot of work. A lot of work. I mean, describe that work. I mean, what was the difference this year compared to past years? Uh, 4 a.m. solo sessions by myself before I had to coach. 5 a.m. classes, sessions by myself between my classes, 90-minute uh, work by myself on the weekends. Um, just a, a lot of time spent in the gym, uh, kind of just in the zone without any distractions. Um, not by choice, but, you know, my fiancé, who was actually here this weekend as well, um, Austin, he, he got the last uh, qualifier, last play, last chance qualifier spot. Mm -hmm. um, we were training together for a while, and then uh, he started doing full-time work, you know, as an arborist, so our schedules didn't line up quite as well, um, and I kind of had to just take that, you know, in and, you know, take rain on it and do what I knew I had to do to get here, and I did. So what are you, what what type of work do you put in now? Well, right now I'm going to put some work in some ice cream and a burger, <laughs> uh, and then give myself a couple of days to really let it soak in and, and enjoy, you know, things that I haven't been able to while training, um, and then right back to it. He's going to be training for the, the last chance qualifier, and we're training partners, so we'll, we'll be there for each other every step of the way.